Drew, and I'm really excited today. I'm going to share with you a peek onto the inside of my closet room. Come on inside. So this is my closet room, and if you guys don't know, I essentially have an apartment in downtown Los Angeles, and it's three bedrooms. I have one bedroom for my roommate, Marie, who's filming this right now, and then I pay for two bedrooms, so this is one of the smaller rooms in the house, and then I have another room, which is my actual bedroom, so I converted this. Originally, it was going to be kind of like a workspace, um, filming space slash closet, but I ended up just converting it into a full-on closet. I'm definitely very grateful to have a space like this that I can use for all of my stuff. So right over here in the first section is just the Ikea Mom three-drawer dresser. I think that's what this is called. Just like uh, knit cardigans, knit sweaters, sweats and things. And this one has socks and underwear. And then up on the, up on the top here are just a lot of my perfumes and clones. So some of my favorite ones, this replica. It's probably one of my favorite ones ever. And then I recently got this new one. It's uh, called Trop or Trope. And I got this uh, in LA, like just like a niche store kind of. Over here is a really cool little storage system I got from Home Goods, And it houses my belts on the top here. And then moving down here are some sunglasses. So my hexagon ones that you guys see me wear all of the time. And then this new one, this is actually from Dita, which I didn't know Dita did menswear, but they have these really cool frames that they sent over. Which I love, and then a couple more sunglasses, these are like some H&M and just some random more party costumey sunglasses, and then just my passport, an old ID um, envelope, and then down here are these fake Gucci patches, don't tell Gucci. I found these literally in the alleys in downtown, and I don't know, I thought I could use them for something, I'm not really sure what, but they're really cool. Moving up here is just a horns that have like some of my jewelry, some rings on it, the skull ring a lot of you guys have seen and then just like necklaces and some other random bits but this is probably my favorite section of the whole room it's just a shoe storage system and it's actually four of these nine cube systems stacked together and it's in the corner here and it just houses all my shoes and then all the boxes box shoes are on the top so i just have a lot of different things in nike adidas these are some new mcqueen ones that i got neil barrett acne saint laurent one of my favorite pairs is this one from Saint Laurent. It's the uh, silver Devon boot, and I'm just totally obsessed with these because I feel like they're super statement, but also you can pair them with a lot because I feel like silver is a very versatile color. And let's talk about these Prada sandals. You guys all hate them. I've seen you. I've seen you talk about these on Instagram and throw shade on Instagram, but they're just like these Tiva-looking Prada sandals, and I think they're really cool. I wear them with socks a lot. There's just a little hamper here. It has all of my dirty clothes in it and that's from World Market. And then I have a couple belts hanging here. This is an off-white one, and this uh, Stussy belt, and then a couple more belts right here, a hat. And then the chair here is just from our old um, furniture set in our old apartment, and we were using the chair, so I thought I would pull it in here, and I think it fits perfectly. Uh, up above is this amazing bar. So this bar is actually from CB2. I really love it. It was, like, it was really affordable as well. I just have a lot of my pieces on here that I quite like. Um, or these are brand new ones that I want to style more of. This is a Balenciaga top that's a bit cropped, and I haven't found a way to style it yet because it's so cropped it's kind of hard to wear. And then this amazing new piece from ASOS, which I need to steam a little bit. It just came out of the package. And then this really cool one. This one is a new jacket I got from Urban, and it's um, Alpha Industries. But I love the color. It's pink, and it's reversible to the gray. Uh, just two framed art prints from Society6. This one's of a leather jacket, and this is like a little line art head, but I love Society6. I've always loved their art, so um, these are just little bits to add to the room. And then because this is a three bedroom um, apartment, each bedroom has a closet. So this is like the built-in closet inside of the room. And this houses a lot of my clothes. So it's just like uh, sweaters, tops, there's long coats at the end there, short sleeves, hoodies, and then lots of different jackets down here. And I'm totally obsessed with this. This is like a uh, new one for me. I got this in Paris, and it's Zara Woman, actually, but it looks a lot like a Balenciaga. Oh, and I forgot to talk about the rug. The rug is from West Elm, one of my favorite rugs ever. I actually got this rug when I was working at West Elm as a home stylist, and it's a it's called the Kolka rug. I will link it for you. And then over the last section of the room is just this rack here. The rack's from Ross, and houses all of my bottoms, I guess you could say. So this is a lot of my pants. Um, this new pair from Top Man, which everyone's telling me these look like Jenko pants, which I don't exactly know what that means, and I hope it's a good thing, but I've been wearing those a lot. And then, of course, I have my vintage Levi's, which I love. This is 
this is like very nostalgic for me. It's my first ever designer item. They're like Margella pants. I got on sale for like $50. And um, these Gucci pants and then a couple other pairs of pants. But these have all of my different pants on them. So there are quite a few options here. That, you guys, basically finishes up my closet tour. I uh, hope you enjoyed, and I know it wasn't too long of a video, but it gives you an idea of what my closet looks like and where I style myself every morning for the past couple of weeks. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, and check the description box for any details um, about anything you might have seen in this video, and subscribe to my channel for more, and I'll catch you next time. Bye! Ooh.